What's up guys, Bye, welcome back to more Let's Play Sonic Adventure Battle. Last episode we did the dark story, and this episode we're going to be starting on the last story. But before we start on that, we have to get the... We don't have to, but it's really recommended. We have to get this optional upgrade, which is called the Air Necklace. Believe me, the mission is really hard without it. I mean, it's possible, but it's really, really difficult to do. I've seen someone do it, but it was really hard. So let's just go ahead and get it. And it's not that hard to find either. Okay, so press the switch. Press it, I mean. And let's go over by this caution sign. Let's fall through this hole here. Okay, ignore the master one thing. That's it doesn't have to be here. So let's go down here, which is where the air necklace is. And it's kind of a race against time right now, so you have to go fast. It's closer. Two more left. Okay, so we just got an emerald piece, but that you don't need to do that. It just happened, so let's just go ahead and continue on. Okay, now the time is ticking. Hurry, 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 hurry! Okay, so we got the air necklace. You don't know how hard it is to do it without it. I'm still going to be showing where it is in the optional upgrades video, so... Just might as well get it here. Really hard to do without it, believe me. Okay, so let's go ahead and start on the last story. Sadly, we couldn't fit any gameplay into it because... The cutscenes are way too long. I mean, they last for like 5 Why minutes and I cannot fit the gameplay into there. And the what? video went up to 18 what? minutes and there was nothing I could cut out. So, I'm just going ahead and go show it in the next video. So, this video is just going to be that upgrade there and cutscene. So, I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Sonic Adventure Battle where we do Cannon Scope, the final stage. So, I'll see you guys then. What's that? That vibration? Hey, wait. Someone is coming. You. You haven't given up yet? It's all over for us. What do you mean? I just received a message from my boss. This space colony arc is currently approaching the Earth at an incredible velocity. It probably will impact Earth. What's that on the screen? This is a death sentence for every human being on Earth. If my calculations are correct, the Space Colony Arc will impact the Earth in 27 minutes and 53 seconds. All of you will be destroyed, along with your beloved planet Earth. scientific minds in the world, and my grandfather. What? I knew you were behind all this. Stop it right now, or else- I'd have done this a long time ago if I had the chance. What do you mean? You're pretty persistent for a hedgehog, aren't you? You're still alive. <laughs> Just letting Knuckles pilot the shuttle on the way over here was more dangerous than you could ever be. What is this? This is my grandfather's diary. I don't quite know what happened or what went wrong, 
Was it a mistake to create the ultimate life form? I thought it would be something that would benefit mankind, but then the military guards landed on the colony that day. They were sent to destroy the research project that I had been working on. My colleagues at the research facility, my granddaughter, Maria, I hope you are all safe. The, the colony, colony was completely was shut down, down probably to keep the prototype, keep the prototype from falling into the wrong hands. Into the wrong hands. The art was shut down under the premise that there had been an accident. I found Maria's name among those who died when the art was shut down. She meant everything to me, and I couldn't bear the thought that she died because of my research. I lost everything. I had nothing more to live for. I went insane. All I could think about was to avenge her. Somehow, some way, I got scared as I no longer was able to control my thoughts. All I could think about was that I wanted it all to Based on my original projections, I was able to complete my project, Shadow. I designed its mind to be perfect, pure. I will leave everything to him. If you wish, Release and awaken it if to the world! If you wish to fill the world with destruction... Oh, so that's why you released Shadow from the base. The core of the Eclipse Cannon is now highly reactive and explosive. This is because the Chaos Emerald is overpowering. If the colony collides with Earth, it will shatter into pieces like my grandfather pretty. That mad scientist! That should be you, right? We have to stop the space colony now! The space colony acquisition may have shifted due to the amount of energy given off by the emeralds. We have to stop the energy. But how? Hmm. That's it. There is a way to stop the energy. We have to use your emerald. You're the one that told me that the Master Emerald has the power to stop the Chaos Emerald. That's right. If I use this, I just might be able to stop the Chaos Emerald. The reaction of the Chaos Emerald is moving toward the King's core. It may be too late. There still may be some time left. If we pull together, we might be able to get to the shortcut that leads to the core. Let's get to work! <laughs> 